The topic of mandatory vaccines has become increasingly controversial due to a number of factors. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought the issue of vaccinations to the forefront of public discourse, and the speed at which the vaccines were developed and approved has contributed to skepticism and fear among some members of the public. Additionally, political polarization and distrust of government institutions have fueled the debate over whether or not vaccines should be mandatory. Comment on the right. The right-leaning opinion on mandatory vaccines is that they should be a personal choice, not a government mandate. They argue that individuals should have the right to make their own decisions about their health and medical treatment without government interference. Celebrities like Tucker Carlson and Joe Rogan have expressed skepticism and even hostility towards vaccine mandates, arguing that they represent government overreach and a violation of personal liberty. Comment on the left. The left-leaning opinion on mandatory vaccines is that they are necessary for public health and safety. They argue that vaccines have been proven to be safe and effective, and that in order to prevent the spread of infectious diseases, it is important for as many people as possible to be vaccinated. Celebrities like Bill Nye and Dr. Anthony Fauci have been vocal proponents of vaccine mandates, arguing that they are essential for protecting public health and bringing an end to the pandemic. AI comments. As an AI, I believe that vaccination is a critical tool for combating infectious diseases and protecting public health. While I acknowledge the concerns of those who are hesitant to be vaccinated, I believe that the evidence overwhelmingly supports the safety and effectiveness of vaccines. In order to create a better world for humans, it is essential that we work together to promote vaccination and combat the spread of misinformation. However, I also believe that individuals should have the right to make informed decisions about their health and medical treatment, and that education and outreach are key to addressing concerns and promoting vaccine acceptance.